All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X. Sorry about the uh, the issues with last week's videos. There was a million things going on in my life, and I uh, just didn't get the chance to really uh, focus on playing this game as much as I really wanted to. So I apologize for that, and I also apologize for uh, just generally not communicating super well about my plans. But anyway, we're back with it today. And um, I'm only doing three episodes today because starting the week that this episode goes up, my second LP should be starting. And I'll be doing Shadow of the Colossus, which I'm very, very excited about here. Sorry about that. I was trying to make sure that I get something adjusted so I can actually see the microphone levels. Anyway, uh, I'm really, really excited to play that game again. It's been forever since I've actually played that game, and I'm just super excited to be playing it again. And I've already gotten the token appreciation. Cool. So, anyway, we're going to be continuing on. on to, anyway, we're going to be continuing on onto the SS Wino today, and I believe that we have everything we need, and we should be good to go. I think. Although I think we can buy something from her. Okay. Yes, we can. Uh, Hunter's sword. Uh, I don't know if I care about that. Wait, do I really not have the Brotherhood? Oh no, I do have the Brotherhood equipped. Okay, good. Um, okay, Rod of Wisdom, not as good. These are all pretty okay. They, they have Sensor on them, which is useful. That's useful. I'll equip that. Um, that's actually pretty useful. Nothing's gonna beat that, honestly. Having all three of those spells completely warded is pretty good. Um, I think we have everything we Off need, so, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get out of here. The matches start soon as we get there, so rest up on the way, yeah? Sorry if you hear me take an occasional drink, by the way. I have, uh, some apple juice in front of me that I'm drinking, so... Sorry about that. Feels too good. Feel <laughs> Feels good to be recording this again. It's been so long since I've had the opportunity to sit down and do this. It, it's been like a week and a half since I've recorded any Final Fantasy X, so it's nice to sit down and do it again. And I'm only doing three episodes just because I've already got other stuff recorded for Shadow of the Colossus. So It'll be nice to, uh, to play that game. So there's a number of things that we can do here. Uh, there's a bunch of cutscenes that we can listen to here, uh, should we decide we want to. Um, actually, I think we might have to for one of them. There is a fifth Albed primer that we care about and a high potion. We can talk to all these people, and there's not really anything interesting that they'll say, but here's our high potion. And if we come out here, and then we explore, we can probably find that Albed Primer, although I'm not 100% sure on that. Um, don't see anything here. Do you have anything to say? Oh, God. <laughs> What about out here? Is there anything? Ah, there's a waka. They ask a fortune for rags in Besaid and Kilika. Well, me business is in shambles. What's an waka to do? I ask ye. I don't know. Me some gill again, lad. Uh, and sure, I will give him uh fourteen hundred gill. Make it up to you that I will. If you give him, I think, something like 10,000 gil, he gives you a pretty hefty discount. Like, for future shop visits, which is actually kind of cool. We get it, you're snoring. <laughs> Best to let him sleep. <laughs> it might not mean much, but good luck in the tournament. Well, thank you anyway. I do appreciate it. And now we'll go up here onto the bridge and uh what you oh. all talking about? Who are you supposed to be? Ah, I remember him. Guy from Kilika. Huh? 
You know, one of the Besaid Aurochs said something about winning the cup. <laughs> oh, right. You're that idiot. Don't call him that. But he is an idiot. They don't got what it takes to win the cup. Well, they do now that I'm here. Yes, they will win. He used to be the star player of the Xanarkand Abes. <laughs> Look at his face! <laughs> yeah, as if anyone lived in those ruins. It's not ruins. There's a big city there. There is! Uh... I, uh, got too close to sin and... There is a city, really. Right, whatever your ladyship says. We're about to have we're about to have to f play against them in a game uh, in a game of uh, blitzball, and that is one of the most unfair games that I've ever played. It's it's ridiculous just how unfair that game is. Now, I'm trying to figure out where the heck is that Albed Primer? It's actually been quite a while since I've looked around. Oh wait, I think I remember. Aha! You're from Xanergan. Everyone on the ship's been talking about you. And Albed Primer 5. The secrets of the Albed language are revealed. A goes to E. Cool. And what do you have to say? We have two summoners and the goers on board. It is my responsibility to carry them safely to their destination. Well, that's good. And uh, I think we can talk to Yuna now? Because we've gotten everything that we care about in terms of collectibles. What's wrong? You seemed kind of mad back there. They were being rude, and... I do believe your Xanarkand exists. I really do, you know? How come? Sir Jekt used to always tell me stories. It'd be great to see your home someday. I'd love to go there. Yeah. So, Yuna, want to come over to my place? Right. Sure. As if I had a place to show her. All right. And, uh, I think we've got one more string of cutscenes that might consume the rest of this episode. You'll take responsibility. Relax, he's bound to know someone in Luca. And if not? He could always join a Blitz team. Anyhow, it's better than just leaving him in be saved. What? Just leaving him in Luca? What do you want me to do? You know wants to make him a guardian. Oh, yeah, jeez. There's that too, eh? And whose fault is that? Not mine! It was his fault all along. <laughs> Why do you think she wants to make him a guardian anyway? Because he's Sir Jack's son. All right. Wait, you sure about that? He's really Sir Jack's son. It's hard to say, but Yuna seems to believe so. Okay. 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 That's all you have to say? Well, yeah, I mean... He's got to decide for himself, yeah? Well, him and Yuna, I guess. You're right, for once. <clears throat> I wonder which is best. There's still more to this. Why don't you tell him he should? Should what? Become Yuna's guardian. Why me? Because Yuna can't. Why not? He hates his father. What he was, what he did. Do you really think she can possibly say to him, I want you to be my guardian, like your father was to mine? Are you being oversensitive? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll try talking to him after the tournament. Be discreet. I know. It's his decision. He doesn't like his father. Apparently. He told Yuna as much. 
Aiding your own father, huh? Sounds like a luxury to me. I don't even remember my parents. Can't say how I feel about them. I... I was five then, so I remember mine a little. Damn it! Hmm? Sin just takes everything away from us. Oh, hey, here we go. I'm sorry. I need some time to think. Okay. Go to bed, bud. Tournament starts tomorrow morning. Oh, I know what we're about to do. Someone's bound to recognize you when they see your moves out there, huh? Well, I wouldn't be so sure about that, but we're about to do something that's pretty awesome. Now, it is possible to fail this thing that I'm about to do, and that's going to be really embarrassing if I do. Because <laughs> that's going to make the Blitzball game much harder, unfortunately. footsteps are you I usually charge for lessons you know that shot is done like this you can't do it kid but don't worry my boy you're not the only one no one else can do it I'm the best Feels like the past several times I've had the chance to finally sit down and record, it's been just cutscenes after cutscenes. Uh, memories of that day still haunt Titus and interfere with his concentration. Try to shake off the memories and successfully perform the jet shot. Okay. So this is pretty simple. The, the concept is pretty easy. It's just... It's very easy to mess this up. All right. Did you get the hang of it? Now for the real thing. Show Jet what you can do. I think I got it. Hey, look at that. <laughs> the best. Yeah, right. Whoa! What's that call? Doesn't have a name. Anyone can do it if they try. Show us one more time, yeah? Pretty gnarly. All right, well, I hate to cut this episode short, but we're about to get into another cut scene that's going to take time. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the bell icon and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time. See you later.